Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and Happy New Year to you too. Happy 2019. It's hard to believe it's already here. So in today's video, I am participating in an open invite hosted by Mrs. V and Denise Jordan from This and That with Denise. And it's all about creating your 2019 vision board. So if that's something you're interested in learning about, stay tuned. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you for stopping by and I hope you enjoy your time here and think about subscribing by hitting that red button below. I'd love to have you join this little community here. Today's video is all about creating your 2019 vision board and this is an open invite being hosted by Mrs. V and Denise Jordan from This and That with Denise and I will leave the link to those ladies' channels below so that you can go check them out. They're wonderful ladies. I know you'll enjoy their channels. And there will also be a playlist for this uh, invite, and be sure to check out that as well. And uh, I'm really anxious to see what other people are going to create on their vision boards. And I've taken a little bit of a different approach to my vision board this year. And I usually like to have one word that represents, that is going to represent my year. And this year I chose the word focus. But it doesn't necessarily mean focus in the conventional sense where I have to be so focused on a task. It's just reminding me to stay focused on what is important to me. And when you see my vision board, you'll get a better idea. But I also put a little sidebar of fun because after all, you have to have fun in your life. Without fun, you're just task oriented and that's no fun. So I have to remind myself that it can't always be about the goals and the visions to remind myself to take time and have fun with family and friends. Now one of the first things I like to do is to go back to my 2018 goals and I have to admit that in 2018 I created my vision board very late in the year and quite frankly I wasn't happy with it and uh, so I'm really glad this invite came along when it did so what I'm going to do is just look at my old board cross off something that didn't work didn't make sense and try to maybe reestablish it in a different way if I liked it or just think about a different a different approach to that goal or maybe it's got to come off the board altogether so here's my vision board and it is positioned right across from my desk so I can reference it every time I'm in this room every time I'm sitting here I can see my 2019 visions and here's my word focus with the sidebar of fun to remind me that life has to have fun in it. And I divided it into my four quadrants and I call it my four P's. Professional, personal, physical, and for lack of a better word, public, which encompasses my YouTube channel, Instagram, social media, things that I want to accomplish there. I work full time, so my professional life and my goals are up here. Uh, I was given the great privilege of a new position last year, which I have to admit was has been quite an uphill learning curve. So I want to continue to grow into that role and become the best I can be at that role. So I want to focus on that in my professional life. In my physical part of my uh, board, physical is just as it means. It's it's not so much about, oh, I got to lose weight or anything. I do. I, I have not been great at my eating habits or even getting back to the gym. So this is all about taking control more. It's more about taking control of my health and making sure I follow through on those doctor's appointments, making sure I follow through on those dental appointments, getting my mammogram done. That's important for women as uh, women of every age but I want to make sure I take control of my health. So that's in my physical part, focusing on my physical well-being. And of course, then I have my personal, which is all about my personal life, my family life, my life with my husband, uh, doing things that we like to do. So that's my board. That's my board in a nutshell. It's pretty simple. 
and I tried to keep each quadrant to two, three goals max for this board because as I divide it into four aspects of my life, if I got more than three in each quadrant, then I'm just getting too much and I would easily lose my focus. So I tried to keep it to two, three max of certain goals in each quadrant. So I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did that you'll think about giving it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and even think about subscribing if you haven't already and be sure to check out Mrs. V and Denise's channel the links are below as well as the playlist I can't wait to see what other people have in store for themselves so thank you Mrs. V and thank you Denise for hosting this very appropriate and timely invite. I really enjoyed it and it got me to sit down and think about what I want to accomplish in my life. So I was very happy to participate. So thank you once again everyone for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed this video and until I see you in the next one, I hope you have a fabulous week. Bye!